Hello, I am Insomniac Jack, and welcome to Firewatch. Um, I didn't have the recording equipment or, or sound recording equipment when I started this, so we're going to be picking up a little, little further from the beginning. So without further ado, enjoy. What was I doing? <laughs> uh, map. Survey communication lines north of the canyon. That's right. Yeah, uh, radio. Hmm. Well, we'll just follow this. I don't remember how to run. Spacebar, shift, alt. Uh, let's remember how to run here. Run, 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 run. Run, run, Rudolph. <laughs> Where's run? Did I miss it? Oh, toggle jog, R. There we go. It's all this over here. Can I get up here? Ooh, lockbox. And we have the uh, very intuitive lock combination of one, two, three, four. Yay! New maps. Hey yo, I got your note about needing to talk. Sorry I didn't track you down, been looking for you all day, figured you'd be out near the canyon helping those grad students, but I guess not. I don't even know how I could really help anyway. We're co-workers, you know, amigos, profesionales. <laughs> if you need someone to throw a case back <clears throat> with and go time traveling, Ron's your guy. But I'm not great with life stuff. You get it? Later, Ron. Okay. Just go ahead and keep that. Stupid pine cone. Anything useful in here? Nope. What did I get on my map here? Wow. I have definitely been around already. Hmm. Okay, so it looks like the only path available to me is s southwest and then north. Oh, wait. Compass. Up southwest. Back that away. Just out of curiosity. Nothing. Back around this way. Okay. 
Uh, for a 40-year-old guy, he sure does run slow. Oh, wait. Yeah. Uh-oh. Beer can. Guess what? What is it? There's a bunch of empty cans up here. Same as before? Yep. These fucking kids. Why do you think they'd be up here? The hell if I know, but they better have stayed away from our communication stuff. Yeah. Hmm. I have a fondness for empty beer cans. Start running again. Sir. Okay, I took the right path. What the? Oh, oh, okay, now I see where it's down. Yeah, okay, the wire's down here. Okay, good. Any sign of those girls? Did they mess with anything? I'll look around. <laughs> More beer. Why is it always empty? I want a full can. Go hell. Hey, so the wire is definitely down out here. I just found it. Yeah, the thing is, it doesn't look like the wind. It looks like it was cut deliberately. I knew it. The moment you said you found their trash. Oh, these idiots are going to pay. Do they realize this is how people die? I mean, what if something happened to one of my lookouts while this was going on? And God forbid there's an actual fire burning out of control. What do you want to do? I want you to go find them. And then what? I... I haven't thought that far ahead. <laughs> that's not true. Everything that comes to mind is illegal. Oh, let's hear it. Oh, yeah? <laughs> hey, I came out here for a breath of fresh air and some adventure. What do you got? I think I want you to just find them and scare the hell out of them. Yeah, I'd make a spooky ghost costume, but they stole my sheets. Hmm, I don't know. Um... Wait for them to wander off and wreck their camp. Something that would make a teenage girl run home to mommy and daddy. <laughs> I'll find them. Thanks. But I am going to need a raise. <sighs> Don't hold your breath. I'd start by hiking back towards your tower and just keep an eye out for anything that would lead you to them. Well, they're big into Red Eagle. <laughs> Great. See if you can find the path they took down from there. Maybe they looped back around towards the lake or something. I doubt they're where they were yesterday, but they obviously can't have gone far. <laughs> All right. Let's go uh, scare the shit out of some teenage girls. Sounds awesome. All right. Find the teens. Ah, uh, okay. Um... What am I... Hmm... All right, what am I? S Dang it. Ah, uh, this is how bad I suck at games like this, especially. Ah, uh, do I? Maybe I'll go to the supply drop up there, maybe? To look out? Throw a fair look out? Maybe I could find him there? Yeah. Yeah. Let's do that. More beer cans. I'm done collecting beer.
Okay, I'm gonna go to the supply drop first. Then I'll circle back. Amazing! How did they know the combination of my luggage? Let's peek two forks, spruce. What? Okay, there's a whole lot of nothing in here, too. Damn it. Useless. Okay. <clears throat> Alright, let's head back. Yeah, this way. Um, and it said this way to the lake, right? Oh, no, 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 no. Was the other way. What? What the hell? Wow. What did I just... Oh. Hey, I'm out at a ravine. What's this thing that spans across it? That is how you get to my sector. No kidding. Well, let me hike over. Well, it's locked up and mainly for emergencies. I've never actually used it. Rangers use it from time to time, but that's it. Help! Oh, God, it's an emergency! Oh, really? <laughs> yeah, I got, I got um, I got eyes on a tornado. I gotta get out of here. A tornado in the heart of the Rockies? Yes. Holy moly! I need to call this in. Tom, Two Forks sees a tornado. He says he needs an evac into my sector. It's a meteorological impossibility. There haven't been tornadoes in the Greater Yellowstone region in a hundred million years. You're gonna need him to stay and take a detailed personal account, even if it means giving his life. Okay, I'll tell him. <laughs> Sorry, hey. No dice. Man. So awesome. Okay, that obviously was not the way. Oops. Tree. Oh man. I tell you, I, I, I don't do much PC gaming. Um I'm just now getting back into it. I uh I custom built this PC just just so I could play Um XCOM two. I just finished that. Uh I hope to play another playthrough of it. So I can record that and hopefully people will enjoy that. If anybody's actually watching this. Haha. Uh -huh. Oh, what do we got here? There's an abandoned pack out here. And it's not one of the teens? No, it looks like it was lost a long time ago. Well, you could always pilfer it for supplies. Mine. Brian Goodwin. <laughs> Well, I am flush with ropes now. That pack was full of them, in decent condition, too. That's lucky. I mean, there's there's enough rope here that I could just leave them hooked up, I think. Oh, get this. This uh, pack came with one of those cardboard single-use cameras. With pictures left? Yeah, he only used three or four. Neato. Thank you, Brian Goodwin. Wait, wait, who? The bag had the name Brian Goodwin sewn into the top. Do you know him? Yeah, I just haven't heard that name in a few years.
What, was he a fella you had a thing with? <laughs> mm, yeah, it was so hot and heavy. Of course, Brian Goodwin was 12 years old, so, you know, our love could never really be understood. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. Not about him being an actual 12-year-old. That part's true. He was stationed in Two Forks, your lookout, with his dad, Ned, three summers ago. Great kid. You can bring children out here? No. You know, I'm not a stickler for rules. They took off halfway through the summer. What, they couldn't uh, handle your unique brand of charm? Not many can. <laughs> Unsurprising. Anyway, so it goes. Have uh, fun with that camera. Try not to snap anything that would scar a photodome employee. I don't know, I got a lot of hiking to do. Might get bored. Well, I'm bored as rocks, so I'll keep you company while you find those girls, huh? <laughs> awesome. Um, I... I don't know when I should use this camera. It's so picturesque. I hope this goes better than my last rope. That one broke. <clears throat> Ooh, supply cache. Where am I on the map? Okay, I'm at cache 241. Hopefully this will give me another section of map. What the flip? Um... Uh... Why can't I... Can't get down? Oh, seriously? All right, that looked like it was three feet. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. Okay. Okay, two forks, fire lookout, lake. Took the long way on that one. Okay. Oh, wait. Whoops. I can report the note. Okay. Hey, who are these guys, Ron and Dave? They're leaving notes for each other in the boxes. Is there any chance one of them was that guy I saw in the canyon? You know, the guy with the flashlight? No, they're both rangers. They're not out here this season. I didn't really know him that well, but I always assumed the only thing Ron cared about was chasing tail and getting loaded. Oh yeah. It's somehow comforting to know that he was able to keep up a correspondence with someone who wasn't going to send him a topless Polaroid. <laughs> so awesome. Okay. Dave, guess who's going out with Debbie next week? No, not that shit heel Steve. It's your man Ron. Went up to check out the new guy at Two Forks and heard him talking to himself more than usual for L.O.'s. So I figured I'd stay away. Remember when you saw Chimney Rock having himself in that hammock? Oh, God. <laughs> I'm starting to think the Forest Service only picks the deranged and perverted. Except for us, of course. We're the creme de la creme. So let's toast to Deb at the spot. Run. Go ahead and keep that one, too. Fossilized claw. Uh, someone found a fossil and put it in a cash box. Could be the same person who left that antler. And maybe they're leaving me an entire creature, piece by piece. Can I keep that? Aw.
Can I throw this? That'd be awesome. Probably shouldn't have thrown those girls' radios into the lake. Alright, let's check out my map update. Ah, okay. So this shows me how to get back to Thunder Canyon, it appears. Um, where is my lookout? Okay, so this will take me... Well, let's just get to that fork. Travel south. South is that away. Don't really want to go to the lake. about snapping at you earlier. Um, I thought about it, and... Yeah, I suppose that must have sounded kind of weird when you heard me take that other call. Plus, you're just out here in your own head. <laughs> Trust me, I know how it is. So... Did you break any hearts back in Colorado when you took this job? I myself have chosen to never get attached to anyone who would miss me, but... <laughs> I know I'm a bit of an outlier. Wait, I don't mean that the way it sounds. I mean, I care about people, and I like companionship as much as the next person. But why does it have to come from the same person for your whole life? My Aunt Kathy was married to the same guy for four decades, and when he died, she found out he'd been having an affair with a real estate broker for 15 years. <laughs> wow. Whereas Oops. my Aunt Judy traveled Oopsie. the world dating artists and musicians as she saw fit. Call me crazy, but I'd rather spend a week in bed with Sonny Bono than half a lifetime with some cheating stockbroker. No, I didn't break any hearts when I left. So, you guys broke up? Something like that? And you're just bursting at the seams to talk about it. <laughs> you really are very perceptive. I know. It's one of my many gifts, along with accents and impeccable night vision. <laughs> Incredible. Why, thank you very much, Governor. Oh, yeah. Pretty pissed off a lot of British people right there with that accent. Oh, what is that off in the distance? Oh, it's a fence. A very crappy fence. Uh, I choose this one. <laughs> Probably didn't matter which one I chose. Okay, where the hell am I? <laughs> oh, I'm on the right path. Okay. I hope I was supposed to go this way. I have no idea whether I was or not. Um. Okay. Burned area. From this burned section of forest, I have no idea where to go. Their trail is pretty cold at this point. Hmm. You're out by Mule Point. No one would camp out in the fireweed. Well, I want you to stay out there, as a favor to little old me. My pleasure. <sighs> okay, we know these young women are sloppy. They must have left some sort of trail. Okay. So, uh, apparently I'm going the right way. Of course, I get stuck, apparently, by the smallest little tree, which is easy to just push over. Right. Guess I'll just explore this whole area. Pretty sure this is south. Zigzagging south. I'm having a hell of a time getting this fucking flapjack off his ass and out to repair that wire. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> what? Do you like that? This guy is the freaking king of the flapjacks. Yeah, that's solid. I'll have to keep that one in my pocket. It's all yours. She wants me. I mean, I'd want me to. In my 40s. Got everything going for me. Alzheimer's, bad hips. Yeah. Although I shouldn't talk much. I'm very nearly there myself. Damn it. What the? Okay. So... 
That must just be a dust devil because didn't she just say it's an impossibility of tornadoes? Yet they put tornadoes. <laughs> okay. Wow. All right. So, boy, I seem to consult my map quite a bit. Oh, okay. Here's my fork in the road. Uh... Oh, okay. I see. I can rappel down this rope. This one down directly to the south. And that will take me back to the canyon. Or... Which I, rem I <coughs> remember that path. Um, yeah. Yeah, I think I'll just go straight up south. <coughs> okay, map. This uh, whole narration thing is new to me, so uh, if, I suck at, if I suck at it, rambling on too much, please let me know in the comments. If you'd like to know more of anything... Anything. You know, if it makes you feel any better, you're a member of a diverse club of lookouts that have come to the thoroughfare after a breakup. There was Vernon, whose wife got put away for running cocaine. Becca, who was widowed after her husband, a jockey, was trampled by his horse. It wasn't anyone's fault. So you just grew apart? We just couldn't be together anymore. How does that make you feel? All right, now she's a psychiatrist. Not very good. Sorry. Yeah, what are you going to do? Yeah, you should feel bad for prying. Ah, uh, like I was saying, um... <coughs> if there's anything I can do differently, make it more interesting, subjects you'd like me to talk about, just let me know in the comments. I'm sure I'll have some very colorful comments. It is YouTube, after all. Oh, wow. That's awesome. Let's take a picture with my camera. It's pretty. Wow. I'm on top of a natural bridge out here. Really? Is it a complete arch? Uh, no. I guess the bridge is out here. <laughs> Still, I think I could jump this gap to get across the canyon. Oh, wow, you're a regular evil Knievel. Oh yeah, you should see the jumpsuit I'm wearing. <laughs> wow. I, 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 I gotta say, I love this game. I do. It's definitely got my sense of humor in it. I am a complete smartass just like this, so it, it is my cup of tea. Okay, we got music for some reason. Why would I climb that when I could lazily come around this way? Where the hell am I? Okay, I gotta get in my map. Oh, oh, okay. Just when I'm like, okay, I know exactly where I'm at. I, uh, screw up and veer off. Okay, let me go back west and then back south. <laughs> oh, yeah, there's the supply cache.
Okay, now I need to head back east. Slightly northeast. This way. No. Oh, God. And this, ladies and gentlemen, is why I play computer games and I'm not out in the wilderness. There's my tower. Hey, do you see that? No. I think I just spotted something. No, but uh, maybe see what exactly? I can barely make it out, but there's a small wisp of smoke way down to the southwest. You should be able to find a way over there from the meadow by the lake. Towards Five Mile Creek, it's in the southwest quadrant of your map. Well, you, you think it's those girls? I'm pretty sure it's a campfire, so yeah, I'd call that a safe bet. Five Mile, Man, they <coughs> five really mile Creek. Do not give a shit, do they? <sighs> not a one. <laughs> I give no shits. Okay, so Five Mile Creek. Well, that's convenient. Okay, um, I guess, oh, well, she said by the lake, so I guess I haul ass back down the lake. Okay, well, I think this is a good stopping point. Um... Hope you guys enjoyed this video, uh, and uh, I'll see you on video two.